okay so here is our next lesson plan from the chapter motion and measurement of distance from class 6th ncrt textbook and at the beginning we are again having the concept map in the concept map as usual we are highlighting the important points by putting them in boxes so this was our concept map after the concept map we are coming to the lesson plan okay so at the start of the lesson plan we will be writing the important details like date class time period and unit subject topic and subtopic after that we will move on to learning points and after learning points we have learning objectives and learning objectives we will again use keywords from bloom's taxonomy like organize compare measure convert point out all these are taken from bloom's taxonomy after that we have previous knowledge of the learners then we will move on to learning resources that we are going to use in the particular class then we have learning processes and then starts the actual lesson plan this is a 5e constructivist lesson plan so we are starting with engage and the students part is more than the teachers initiative because this is a constructivist classroom or this is a constructivist lesson plan where teachers job is to uh, encourage the students or provide them opportunity to take active participation in the classroom activities so here is our engage part engage part is continuing in the next page also after engage we have explore and explain then again we have explore or explain you can pause the video or take a screenshot whenever you want to explore and explain is continuing here after that we are we are moving on to extend extend is continuing after extend we have oh again extend it is continuing and after extend we have evaluation which is done at the end of the class to check students understanding and at the end we have home assignment for the students that's all thank you